fever. Is it really? Yeah. You know what I have? What? I have the fever. I have the beaver fever. Oh. Yeah, that's how I intimidate like places. I'm like, no, you can't know close when you're problem this. There are beavers around here. Oh, I love beavers. What's the saying from that uh, show? Um, I have, I have the fever, and you know what the only cure is? More, ca I'm butchering it. More cowbell. Uh, that's from Saturday. Will Ferrell movie. Saturday Night Live. Do you know the line I'm talking about? I do. Yeah. More do you, cowbell. Do you remember how it goes? No, but I know the more cowbell thing. Well, I have a fever, and the only way it gets cured is more beaver fever. Magpie told me that Giardia is also referred to as beaver fever. Maybe it's cryptosporidium. Either way, one of those very <gasps> common... If it's cryptosporidium, I've had beaver fever, legitimately. Yeah. Oh, yes. I don't remember which one it is, but they will give you... Beaver poop carries one of those, and it's not very pleasant. No, well, I've had the fever for many beavers. I mean, you probably got it from people, considering that you drink water near a hot spring. People juice? People juice. Ew. Or it might have been norovirus or E. coli. Oh, I have a feeling it was crypto. Yeah, I mean, you were pooping yourself for weeks. I didn't poop myself. Okay, you were almost pooping yourself for weeks. There were many calls each day that were closer than I would prefer. Yes. Well, folks, that's a good ramble to get good off. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Start your morning talking about beaver fever, pooping yourself, crypto. All the good stuff. Um, so yeah, morning, morning. We are cruising. We got about eight to ten miles. I don't know why I estimated at eight. It's actually ten. Um, until we meet Jim and Elizabeth again, and we're gonna step some miles together with them. We got some canal walking in the morning, and we're always looking for more of that beaver fever, folks. Magpie said if I go no filter, no problem on the water sources around here, I'll find the beavers, but I'll also get the fevers. Yeah, maybe don't do that. Yeah. Yep, that's a good morning for you. Day 15, we're cruising. All right, folks, ready for this pan? Get ready for this pan. It blew my mind this morning. It didn't blow Magpie's mind as much, but it blew my mind. One, two, three. Y'all, all that blue in the distance, it's not mountains. You just can see forever. Wow. We're already in uh, the Midwest. No, this is not the Midwest. There's hills. How did we already get to the Midwest? That was quick. It's definitely not the Midwest because there's hills and trees and things other than just corn. That's true. We, we blinked and it was done. So cool. Really beautiful. It turned really, really beautiful, really quickly this morning i mean look at this it's so green very cool folks very very cool i got that fever cooking in the micro that is a weird combination of songs all right we'll end it there I got that happy trigger figure this morning, folks. I just can't stop filming. Oh, there are cows on that hill. It's just so beautiful. These rolling hills. I love it. It's a pretty house. I'm a fan, folks. I am a giant fan of what's going on around here. Have you all ever seen a more beautiful sign in your life? It says, cattle pasture ahead. Yes. Yes, please. Bring me to the promised land. Bring me to the promised land. Yes, please. Oh, it's thick grass. But I'm okay with that if you bring me to the cattle pasture. Where are you? I am absolutely furious folks false advertising telling me i'm walking through a cow pasture and not even letting me see one cow Psh, false advertising they grabbed my heart with that trust i put so much trust telling me when they're going to see cows and then they just ripped it away 
ripped it away. It's so cold, so cold hearted. You like my dramatic scene? I do wish there were cows there though, however, but no cows. It is upsetting, but not that upsetting. Pretty upsetting. False advertisements. Ugh, can't deal with it. All right, they're trying to regain my trust with benches. But I gotta tell you folks, you tell me there's gonna be cows there, and then there's no cows there, it's gonna take a lot more than just a nice bench, but man, that is a nice bench. You're close. It's gonna take a lot more than a nice bench. It's gonna take two nice benches to regain my trust. Yeah, way more than one. Um, I want cows. Really pleasant walk this morning, folks. Really pleasant walk. Beautiful again. All right, I forgive you, Trail. I forgive you. They gave me a second bench. I'll forgive them for that. For that cow misleading fiasco. I forgive y'all, but it still hurts my heart. It still hurts you would bend my trust like that. Well, not even bend. You broke my trust trail. Tell me I'm going through a cow pasture, no cows. But that was pretty beautiful. Awesome trail. Love it. All right, so you pass by this old quarry. I don't know how operational it is. And with the sun being where it is, you're not going to be able to really get a good look into it. Um, it's... It's a good size. It's not giant, giant, but it's a good size. Beautiful on the ridge up to the quarry. Um, you're kind of walking on your, well, I just turned around. So on my, on my right, nice little views into the valley. On the left, kind of tucked into these trees. Really beautiful place. So it came off the two track and now you did a few switchbacks up a little bit of rock to hop onto this single track. Um, don't know if it's trying to put you around something, but yeah, put you on single track, which is nice. Still upset about the cow, the cow lies, the cowspiracy. I know that's a movie, but the cowspiracy hurts too much on this trail. Beautiful. Oh. This is beautiful countryside. So we just did that single track that I was telling you about. It's kind of, you get up to get down with the thickness. And then um, you turn on a road, you take a right if you're going westbound. And I'm going to double check the maps, but this is the way the blades pointed. I probably checked the maps, we're good. And yeah, just beautiful countryside this morning. That quarry going up towards that was awesome. Blue blaze on the road again. So, uh, as soon as I start filming, a car comes. So you see a lot of signs that say towns and cities, but you don't see a lot of places that say hamlet. Um, it's saying, welcome to the hamlet of Perryville. Sorry, that might have been a little janky footage. I was trying not to film the truck, but we're walking into a hamlet. Hamlet of Perryville. Pretty cool. Oh, somebody went all out. All right, there are too many cute things to film in that hamlet. I don't want to get too much footage there for y'all. So we turn on Sabom Bomb Street. Um, there's a couple blazes right there. And my footsteps just got janky because I wasn't watching. But that was a really cute hamlet. Go check out the hamlet of Perryville. There's a chonky basset hound that I really wanted to film, but the owners are out in the yard, so I didn't. But I was tempted. So chonky. Oh, I love chonky basset hounds.
So cool. Best video clip of the day. Oh, we're not going to get better than this, folks. Soak it in. Soak it in. Ready for this pan? Even two more. Best video clip of the day. All right. You ready for another fantastic view? Watch this. Look at that. Hell yeah, folks. Hell yeah. These rolling hills are so beautiful. And these homes are just immaculate too. Wow. All right, I misspoke. This might be some of the best footage you get today. Look at that. Oh yeah, talk to me, baby. What you need? What you need, buddy? Oh my God, it's just so beautiful around here, folks. And I'm pretty sure, almost positive. Good morning. So, beautiful, beautiful cows. Um, almost positive. Oh, the cow's coming up to me. Almost positive. I... Oh, I'll film in a second. All right. I didn't want to film back there because I wanted to be respectful. Almost positive that was kind of like an Amish um, type homestead we passed. Um, the locals around there. I don't want to. I don't want to sound. I was gonna say is one the cow is super beautiful but two I'm pretty sure kid could not have been older than 10 eight is even pushing it driving a forklift <laughs> uh, that's rural counties for y'all folks that is rural counties um, could not have been older than 10 eight is pushing it too but yeah that made me chuckle um, yeah beautiful countryside just beautiful countryside we're going to keep on cruising. We go right at this junction. All right, so it's a hard left turn. Um, so stay on your P's and Q's, but very well blazed. Um, oh, wow, beautiful. So, yeah, very, very well blazed. Hard left, and it puts you back on kind of two-track. Wow, it's so green. <clears throat> okay, we're about, I don't know, two or three miles from the Chittany Falls area, I believe. Um, and that's where we're gonna meet up with Jim and Elizabeth. They're gonna step some miles with us today. I think they're gonna step about 10 miles, so pretty cool. Um, yeah, so we got this for a little bit until then, I think. We'll find out. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? That was a chonky woodchuck. Yeah, you that wow. That was cute. That was cute. Oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, big trail sign. You always can tell when we're getting closer to towns with the better signage. Super sweet. All right, so right before that road crossing, I didn't grab it on footage, but there's a trail log. Um, stay on your R's and W's. You'll be able to see it. So it's kind of like a little birdhouse looking thing. And yeah, we're getting closer and closer to the town. 
we are hiking with Jim and Elizabeth, as you can see up there, and it's a nice, nice sharing mile. So I'll grab some clips along the way as we cruise. So we are getting to the outskirts of Casanova. This is the old train station, apparently. Um, and just a cute little town. We're gonna walk by, oh, look at this. Walk by the place. Um, smells good too. I'm getting distracted. I'm gonna take pictures and keep hiking. All right, we are in the town of Casanova and um, we are kind of walking up the main drag. There's a car wash going down, down the street a little bit. Um, I asked them if they washed packs. They did not wash packs, unfortunately, but all is good. Um, we're gonna cruise on up and I'll see if I can get some film of them showing us this place that they got married. It's pretty sweet how that worked out, so. Really cool little little town. So right before the trailhead, as you're walking out of town, you can see everybody right there. Um, there's this little cute community garden that you got a little entrance. I gotta get some of these quotes. That one might be raising kids. At least the pay sucks, Jim Gaffigan. I like this one as soon as you came in. I don't even like cats, but I like that quote. Well, let me say, say that again. It's not that I don't like cats, but cats don't like me. That's better. I don't know where I'm going. I love that one. Don't like the person that said it, necessarily. I'm giving you all too many opinions. I gotta let you just see the viewage. Oh, that's so cool. All right, folks, I gotta go catch up to the crew. Not. It's so cool. It's like we're in like a baby Jurassic Park. I'm not vegetarian, but I'll still eat some leaves. All right, so Magpie left us in the dust. Um, we're about a mile, maybe, outside of a state park or little park that we're gonna grab lunch at. There's good agua through this trail system. Um, once you get out of the town, it's good filterable water. And yeah, we're gonna keep on cruising, then grab, grab some lunch and we'll see Magpie again at some point. He's down the trail somewhere. But yeah, maybe about a mile until lunch. Um, really beautiful trail that they routed through after the town of Casanova. Um, these link trails that the NCT has done in between these rails trails or these bike trails or these canal trails, really beautiful single track. They've done a really good job on it. Cool, cool. Some guy's favorite spot to hang out. Some good, good maintainers that are showing, uh, sharing his love with the nature around here with it right next to a good creek. Please stay on trail and we turn this way. I think we're about to climb something called Quarry Hill. We'll see right now. It's awesome, NCT. All right, we're cruising on up. Apparently there's a magpie somewhere up on top of that hill. To the left. TP? Uh, okay, so. There's a magpie at a TP. I don't think I would have ever said that sentence. Guess the trail goes that way. 
for now, we're going in and choosing to explore a cool bald area. Really sweet. Huh? I think that's the title of this piece. They're referencing my belly after eating lunch? Yeah. Yes. Alright, so we had a nice little picnic at um, Art Park. Art Park. And um, Jim and Elizabeth, as you can see behind us, they brought some blankets, so that was super awesome. And it was nice just sitting in some sunshine, having a chat, just uh, eating some grub. I offered hot dog juice to everybody, and nobody took me up on it. They say they didn't want to take it away from me, but I have a very strong feeling that they're just humoring me. I don't know. We'll, we will see. But I will always offer hot dog juice to anybody I see, so if y'all want some... Magpie, you want some hot dog juice? I'm good for that one thing. Okay. Hike, hike, hike then. This is cool. This is cool. I got to put some juice on And now we are going down the mountain. The... And then we get back on the road for a while. The 10,000-foot mountain that we climbed. We are going down. It took us about six hours to reach the top. We started before the sun was up and we're just getting down before the sun comes down. But no, that was actually a cool little top of the hill. Quarry Hill, Quarry hill has a park on top. Really cool. Um, and I hear a barco, so. Oh, and we got another hard left. All right, so the trail turns into a road after you drop down off Quarry Hill. Um, nice road for a little bit of chunk of change, but it's a really, really beautiful road. Got really nice rolling hills in the distance. As always, Magpie's Road crushing. And yeah, really beautiful land. That's that old, old NCT blaze. the road I can cross the road all right look at that NCT sign it's a big boy it's a big one all right folks we're about three miles from the north not north country trail we're on the north country trail about three miles from the Finger Lakes trail we're just leaving Jim and Elizabeth um super awesome we link, linked up for about eight or nine miles and just cruise together um I didn't really do a lot of filming while we were together with all of us because I asked them about filming and they were cool with being on film but didn't really want to be chatting on film and stuff like that which is super cool but really nice to share some miles and thank you guys if you're watching this for coming out it was super enjoyable to share the experience together so thank you um we're about to get into the Finger Lakes trail here shortly let's get it I know the like how she's so cute and I'm like I, I don't know that question actually Genetics, water, breed, I don't know. Yes? Haha. <laughs> wow, that is really pretty. So, it brings you on a bridge over the swamp, but Magpie wants to bushwhack the swamp. So, we're gonna go shwack some swamp. Barky. No, 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 no. That's a big Barky. Really? Oh, big Barky. All right, so you get off the road walk. NCT does a very good job of signing the link trail. And we got a little bit of the link trail, um, I don't know, for a mile or two, and it should connect us into the Finger Lakes. Let's go. Oh, that's 
good agua. Baby gonna sign again? Yep. Another trail register. Lots of these. Yes, there are. No, to North Dakota. Oh, where is that? Oh, at 4, the very bottom. Miles. All right, folks, we are underneath 4,400 miles. Whew, we're close. That 4,600 is calculated to the crown point. Yeah. So we're doing 47 4, about. Whoo, baby. 4,376 4, miles. That's the first sign we have seen that shows how close we are to the end because what's the point of putting those in there really um you got a while you don't really you don't need to know how far you got a while um but that was the first one that showed you that was pretty cool Another one. oh it's a better view oh yeah 224 miles we've come 330 yeah, that's calculated to crown point guess what, what? 4400 miles to go uh huh, is there a magic button? There's a little bent off nail. There usually always is a magic button. Uh huh. You just gotta find the magic button. Sometimes it's harder to find than not. Uh huh. I'm gonna find a place to sit down. Another trail log. Yep. Shout out, Buck. We were flipping through looking for the last NCT or to come through here. And it I think. It was three years ago. It was three years ago. I'm pretty sure it was you. We didn't find anyone else. Um, that was doing an NCT through hike or section hike or whatever it was. Enigma. Oh, Enigma did a section. Enigma was doing a section, but I think you were completing up your through buck. So shout out. You were back in 18. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a minute. All right, folks. I'm on the ground again. This log is not stable. The, the first time this log went down a little bit, the second time it fully broke. I think we need to get off this log. Oh, my ass, okay. my ass, my neck, my back, my neck and my back. Oh, no, my pride. Oh, don't sit on that while you can anymore because, well, now you can actually, and it, and it won't fall down. Oh, my neck, my back, my neck and my back. Don't sit on that log. Dry foots. Oh, you can make it. It's like a dock. It's very unstable. Once more. Don't step on it at the same time as me. It's extremely, extremely unstable. Woo! 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 Couldn't step on it since baby was, so I got wet feet. Rude. Oh, almost fell. just has you turning down this person's driveway. Oh my God. <laughs> it's cool, but it's also a person's driveway. But you cut to the right here shortly, so not that big of a deal. Uh-oh, Barco. Barky. Fluffy. There's a fluffums. All right, don't try to do this part October 1st through December 25th. Don't exactly know why, but don't do it. 
Wow, it's just cut into here. Logs on logs on logs. This is what, the sixth log maybe today? Yeah, something like that. And we got it signed up. Let's see what we got going. Um, so if we can make this stick, folks, would really appreciate it. Whoa. Fluffy McFluffyton for Magpie. And Fluffers Sir Fluffed for me. No. Please, guys. We re really would appreciate it. Please do not. Magpie says yes. Magpie is tired. Fluffy McFluffington. No. <laughs> All right, folks. We got a pipe spring, actually. Um, Mile and a half. Sometimes you got to do your own piping on the trail, and sometimes you, they give you a pipe spring. <laughs> <laughs> I like pipe springs. All right. Um, yeah. NCT, baby. That's a nice bench. That is a nice bench. It's a baby bench. Oh, they're coming over, folks. They are coming over. Yeah. They're showing off. You big show-offs, you. You big show-offs, you. Uh-uh, magpie. You wanna try to touch? Y'all just showing off. Oh, look at you with your fine self. I think we walk right through the farmer's property. The map said it cuts right through. Yeah. That's unique. The NCT literally goes right through this farmer's property. Right through their yard. Right through their yard. Um, I guess it's also the Finger Lakes Trail though. Yeah. Oh yeah, like this little marker up top. I know. Really? That's very unique. That's cool. It smells like cows. All right, like I said, sometimes the trail provides some pipage. Sometimes you have to provide your own, but this time it provide the trail provided the pipage. So if you look at that, look at how piped that is. That's a good pipe. Um, it's right at the turn before you climb up into the hills. You literally walk through that farmer's yard, take a turn, come down here. Incredibly well marked. Look for the turn off of after that farmer's yard and before you do your climb. And turn off of Weber Road. Weber Road, and you can find that Good, good pipage. How good of a pipage, you ask? It's pretty excellent pipage. I could rate pipage all day, and that's an excellent pipage. I'm tired. Yeah, we're gonna get some pipage water. All right, folks. We got that fresh pipage water. Um, how many can I, times can I say pipage within a day of filming? I don't know. I think we got it pretty high up there. Um, so we got that fresh pipage water. One more. And we got a little climb up to the tippity toppity. I don't know if it's to the tippity toppity. We go up a little hill. And then we go down the other side and there should be camp um, a little less than three miles from where we're at. So we're going to start cruising. And I think as I've talked, it puts you off of these farm roads. That was so cool that that farmer with those silos Let's see, just walk straight through his property. Um, there's an NCT sign in his property. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, so thank you. Don't know you, but thank you. Ooh, look at this. We go. Cheaters never win. Ah, oh, rude. Just ignored me. All right, folks. We're pretty much at the tippity toppity hoppity floppity bippity boppity coppity soppity. <clears throat> yeah. If you go really quick, you breathe in bugs. Oh, and there's a chair at the top. That's nice. 
That's very nice. <clears throat> oh man, I think I got two of them. But tippy toppity hoppity fobbity boppity boppity kippity hoppity. Whew. Yeah. Um, cruisy. About 400 feet. <clears throat> wow. We're just sitting in my throat playing some bongos with my tonsils. Oh, 1,200. Oh, 1,200 feet. Huh. Didn't feel like 1,200 feet, but I believe it. Um, yeah, those bugs were playing bongos with my tonsils. Um, could have said something else that started with a T, but I don't think the bugs got there yet. So we're at the top. We're at the top, and we got a mile and a half. Mile, mile and a half. I haven't looked at the PDF yet. Okay, we cruise. The NCT went blaze crazy, folks. Which is a good thing. It's uh, really well blazed through here. Extremely so. So we're about to go touch a road um, for just a tiny bit and then climb the next little bump in front of us. So... Yeah, not too much farther. Um, good day today. Good day. Got to spend some time with Jim and Elizabeth. Um, had some nice cruising this morning. Had some nice cruising afterwards. Had some nice cruising together. Just, yeah, really pleasant. Ooh, got some squelch right now. Squelch, squelch. Oh, that's some good squelch, folks. That is some good squelch. It's because there's a little pond, I think. Or because the trail sometimes just likes to give you a squelch. Sometimes it gives you a nice little squelch hug and you got to say, thank you, trail. And I did. Oh, I like this little elevated part. Without it, it would have been pretty tough. I would highly, highly recommend not relying on that lake for water. It is... I mean, once you get near it, you'll know why. Yeah, awful. it is pungent. Um, so that's the lake right before you hop on this road for a quick second. Then we cut uphill somewhere over yonder. So don't rely on that. I mean, you can drink it. You're gonna probably have a bad. Yeah, you're gonna. Pro yeah, you're gonna have a bad time. It. It's pungent. Quite pungent. Yeah. <laughs> Quite pungent. All right, folks, that is Tromp Lake, and it does not look... Tromp Pond. Tromp Pond. Okay, it looks like a pond. It looks like a dry pond. Um, I'm filming from inside the tent. It's like 620. The gnats um, are going nuts. Yeah, the gnats are nuts. Luckily, they're not biting, but um, pretty thick clouds. They're so, really trying to go for the eyes. Yeah. So this was uh, kind of our campsite for the night. Um, not really much more going forward for another six miles about. So... Yeah, um, 6.20, good time to get into camp. Did about 28 today, which is good. And beat the bugs, for the most part, in. And yeah. I, I guess I usually don't get film at the end of the, the day, but thought I would let you know that we're in the Finger Lake Trail. And today's day 15. Yep. And yeah, folks, good day. Good day? Yeah, good day. Good day. All right. Hmm? Nice to be with Elizabeth and Jim. It was. Huge shout out, folks. Thanks for the Gatorade, water, the company. the company, just cruising, having a good time. So day 15, half a month on trail. Sweet. Hey, my KT tape is...